Hunter and Central Coast residents have been bombarded with COVID vaccine cancellation text messages. The Premier is standing up every day and telling people in our region to get vaccinated. And as those words are leaving her mouth, people are receiving text messages cancelling their appointments. Like, it's just wrong and it needs to be fixed. Like local mother Leah, who had her appointment cancelled via text yesterday, saying that the Pfizer jabs from the Central Coast were being redirected to vaccinate Sydney's HSC students. I'm all for sharing the vaccine for those people who need it, but not, not when it's just coming from certain areas and not everywhere. And the other thing is, like, how many kids are there that need it? Like, are we that short on vaccines? Has, has the government really created this situation where we're down to thousands of vaccines when really we should be we should be flooded with it we should all be getting vaccinated premier why are um, Pfizer doses for the high school kids coming from the central coast when the central coast is in lockdown is it just a coincidence that many of the seats on the central coast happen to be labor seats um, first of all, that question offends me. We're doing what is in the best interests of public health. But there are 8 million citizens in New South Wales. All of us are making a sacrifice. And if it means that some people have to wait a few extra weeks before they get their Pfizer, I think people would appreciate... But it's in the lockdown zone. That's that's that's. Why, I think I think people that their their decisions their decisions that our health department takes uh, how how the vaccines are allocated is not a decision that someone like myself would take. Does that puzzle you that health have decided to take? It that does not puzzle outside? me because what is really important is for our health officials to do what they are expert at. The premier clearly has made a very big error here. I know today she blamed health for that, uh, but she is the Premier and therefore she is in charge. She's the boss. Um, and the error has been that they have inadvertently, obviously it's a mistake, they couldn't have done this intentionally, um, they're, they're taking vaccine from one lockdown area and putting it, in another vac uh, putting it in another lockdown area. Now, where is the health advice that says that that is a good thing to do? I ask this question. Is the same happening at other health districts throughout the Sydney area that is in lockdown? And if the answer is no, then why is the Central Coast? And if we're not that at risk, which we've been told for weeks that we are at risk, if we're not actually at that, like, at risk, why are we still in lockdown? Meanwhile, the Parliamentary Secretary for the Central Coast, Adam Crouch, has defended his government and says it's a federal issue. Well, we have asked the Premier and the Health Minister to, uh, first and foremost, make sure that they uh, redirect those appointments that have been cancelled for people on the Central Coast uh, as a matter of priority. And they need to look at this decision that they've made, which clearly was a mistake, um, about uh, redirecting Pfizer from the Central Coast to Sydney. The region's Labor MPs are also calling for a max vaccination hub on the Central Coast. It is the only significant region in New South Wales that does not have a vaccination hub. Sky Hull, Central Coast News.